book questions of the writing section on the SAT and this again is January 2007 DEM BM uh, PDF and uh, let's go ahead and attack question number 12 hearing the unexpected loud noise okay so who is hearing it that's exactly what you're gonna ask once you see the comma because it's a modifying sentence so Cindy Larry and I not me that's uh, that's there here usual number 12s are really easy to attack uh, so let's go ahead and move on to number 13 and I know there is nothing wrong with a C or D um, 13 many admire Louis M. E. Alcott for her detailed descriptions of descriptions of 19th century domestic lives life in novels such as blah but few have read the theory she writes in her early career this is the uh, early in her career goes uh, in the past and rice writes is a present tense so therefore um, answer choice D should be incorrect let's go ahead and look at 14 according to some critics okay we can ignore that the title character of the Greek Oedipus Rex saw himself as the savior of his people. Okay, saw himself and believed. So there is ro something wrong with a parallelism error here. So answer choice C would be a correct answer for number 14. Let's go ahead and look at number 15. This, um, when a sentence starts with uh, unlike something or something like that, is usually usually again I should say usually turns out to be a um, comparison error so however in this sentence I can tell that it's not comparison error because it's conjunction error neither nor and this should shouldn't be that hard to um, this sh shouldn't be hard to uh, spot that error so answer choice P on this one and moving on to number 16 one subject of I'm just going to remove prepositional phrase like I said and in fact it turns out that whole sentence here is a prepositional phrase, so I can say that published more than 40 years after it has been written novel is the legendary huh what I can do here is uh, I can just uh, remove this cancel this marks out and uh, there's a positives here which I can cancel one, of, one subject of the person's novel is the illusionary nature of passage of time alright let's see how this is going and after it has been or it had to been after it had been hmm. answer choice C strikes out to me however we'll get back to that so I'm gonna leave a check mark here joining the grassroots movement against inhuman working conditions okay who is joining some consumers so that's right in the United States have stopped pulling products from countries in which workers uh, look okay so I see the error where it is so it says plural workers are essentially a slave laborer a uh, is just changing the plural into singular which is um, you want to keep your pronouns consistent so and this problem answer choice D is the correct answer Let's move on to number 18. As the mayor was evaluating the proposed tax, so who was evaluating the mayor? Okay, this sentence is correct. He was less interested in the revenue it would generate than in whether they, okay, proposed tax, different, okay, so it, the sentence is the main subject. The main subject here is tax, which is singular. And uh, here, as you can see, the SAT test writer uses an it format. 
However, once uh, once we go past that, they suddenly change it into they. And uh, this again is the same type of error discussed in question number 17. And let's go ahead and move on to number 19. Eating garlic has long been regarded as a means of warding off malice, and scientific research has shown that it, it garlic, okay, does have some therapeutic value. In this sentence, I don't see any error off the top of my head, so I'm going to circle E, no error. Let's go ahead and look at number 20. Although, okay, although the night shift is, is fully staffed, the managers always holds the managers okay managers plural holds and it should be always hold us so I think the answer choice here would be uh, as in there is in B because the pronoun does not match to noun looking at number 21 Members, okay, we don't know the members of members have, which is correct, so I'm going to cancel that. Once again, shown how the combination of strength and this is being, and uh, once the being is shown, answer choice C, you know that's going to be the answer. And Taylor's novel, The Accidental Tourist, so the novel we don't care what the name is the novel features so that's good a character whose ob obsession with saving time and money so obsession with okay with usually with is considered a prepositional word so with saving time and money is obscured so or changing it to or um, is just a trick to uh, trick you that it's the author says saving time and money are two things however using prepositional phrase before it makes it one thing so that's the reason why uh, answer choice D should be the right answer and looking at number 23 at the conclusion of novel The Great Gatsby Nick Carraway a young middle western middle midwesterner recently arrived to New York arrived to New York moodly watches the blinking green light at the this sounds good hmm. arrived to New York should be arrived arrived in New York so I think answer choice A this type of error is a diction error. And you must know the diction that comes right after the verb is used. So I think it's A, arrived in New York. Okay, let's go ahead and look at number 24, the last one for this section. Uh, despite the efforts of publicity committee, despite the efforts of that, Hardly anyone attended the workshop that had been planned, so painstakingly. Despite this, another thing happened. So there is a contradiction going on. So despite is used correctly. Hardly anyone, that's good, that had been planned. Had been planned, since it's in the past sentence, works out as well. And therefore, I can say answer choice E. Is the right answer so for right now that's the let's just go ahead and finish it off with three more questions three or five Peter seemingly effortless fights okay we don't need to know that so we just we are just gonna make it a prepositional phrase and ignore that this whole thing achieve through something continue the delight to those who see the play Peter Plank and here achieved is used in the past so this must be used in the past as well so this again is a tense error and I'm going to circle C and move on 26 meditators were standing by prepared to intervene in labor dispute even though both sides 
had refused earlier offers for assistance. Here, for assistance offers. This sounds good. Intervene in is good, even though it's good. Had refused is good. And uh, I think it should be D. Earlier offers to for assistance does not make any sound. Go oh, argument. According to some theorists, okay, though we don't know or we don't care what the theorists think, what any particular bird can eat could change with even the slightest variation in the shape of its beak. Okay, what any bird, okay, what any bird can eat could change with even the slightest variation in the shape of its beak. So answer choice E is right. And here we have neither nor, so that cancels off. No conjunction error right there. Um, Miss Ta uh, Tanaka believes that watching TV as much as her son, Sam does, watching TV believes that well huh this is a comparison error because it's comparing watching TV to her son and uh, we cannot compare two things like that so I think answer choice C is the right answer so let me go ahead and move on to the last one. An amateur potter herself, the accountant, offered to help the artist with his business accounts. So this is a positive. We can uh, cancel that out. Amateur potter, uh, potter herself, complicated as they were by his unusual system of record record clean keeping now let me go ahead and make sure how many uh, no errors have we circled so far so two three and we know there should be four of them so we can uh, safely that say that uh, this is no error and uh, this is how I I would attack my SAT writing. So see you on my next video. And right for right now, let me go ahead and check if my answers are correct or not. So let's go ahead and check it out. So I checked the answers and uh, they all are correct. And we solved up till now 29 questions. And out of that, I got 29 of them correct. And in the next video, I'll be looking at uh, section uh, 10 of the SAT for the writing section and uh, solving that those questions with you so keep watching the videos for more understanding